welcome back to Vlogmas. Now don't worry, I haven't actually been sat here all night. I've been working on some stuff for the gig today, so I'm looking at my setup. And since I did my last gig, I've actually made the setup a little bit smaller than it was. So I got this fantastic DB speaker up here, which is a powered one. So it takes up a lot less room, but it's quite a loud speaker. Uh, pardon the expression. Not just a clever name. So what I'm doing is I'm just sort of working through my set and making sure all the sort of production side of it is a lot easier. Because that way I can just turn up, plug it all in, and then I'm ready to go. So I've got main stage set up here with all my songs down the left hand side. And I put my set list in there and I'm just sort of programming that in as we speak. It's quite fun actually. I really enjoy the technical side of this actually. Like some gigs it is quite nice to turn up with an acoustic guitar and just plug into the system and just go. But when I'm on my own I tend to do stuff like looping like I mentioned the other day and using like half tracks and things like that. But yeah at the moment I'm just sort of sat working through that and working through. So I'm just stopping for a cup of tea now because I've been at it for a few hours now, sort of playing with settings and tweaking things, and there's definitely a few issues I need to solve before the gig, but I'm not going to solve them by sitting there and staring at the screen. I need to walk away and do something different. So a cup of tea is always the best answer in this scenario, I find. Cup of tea, bit of meditation, you can't beat it. I'll tell you what will make a nice break from proceedings, the Christmas song advent calendar. So let's see what's behind door number 20. Oh, we're into the 20s. I genuinely cannot believe that. It's like five days now. Okay, let's see. Let it snow. Such a nice song, isn't it? Well, the weather outside is frightful, but the fire is so delightful. And since there's no place to go, let it snow, let it snow, let it snow. And it doesn't show signs of stopping. And I bought some corn for popping. The lights are turned way down low. Let it snow, let it snow, let it snow. When we finally kiss goodnight, how I'll hate going out in the storm. But if you really hold me tight, all the way home I'll be warm And the fire is slowly dying But my dear, we're still goodbye But as long as you love me so Let it snow, let it snow, let it snow But if you really hold me tight All the way home I'll be warm Oh, the fire is slowly dying But my dear, we're still goodbye But as long as you love me so Let it snow Let it snow Let it snow So there you go, let it snow so I'm just walking into town now. I've got a haircut in about 45 minutes, so I'm tremendously early. So what I'm going to try and do is find all the most Christmassy things I can in Doncaster to include in this basic Christmas montage. So roll the Christmas montage. Oh, 
open it. So, I am back very briefly. Oh, hello adjustment, there we go. So I'm back very briefly, obviously having had my hair cut, nice and short. I'm actually heading out with Dan and Hannah tonight. We are, we are going climbing. And I'm not going to take the camera with me. Um, have a bit of a break from the vlog. Um, but a couple of updates first. First of all, I can feel a cold coming on, so I bought a bag of clementines, which I know it doesn't really work like that, um, but I've always found that if I absolutely mainline vitamin C, I can almost fight it off for a couple of days. So that would be extremely useful. But also, <laughs> I'm taking over Dan and Hannah's presents now. <laughs> this will give you an idea as to how good I am at wrapping. I, this is genuinely my best effort. Usually I leave it to Lizzie. I defer it. Obviously apart from her own presence, that would be odd. But those are the only ones that I usually wrap the ones for Lizzie. And it's one of these things where I've tried to learn how to do it over the years and I'm just absolutely terrible at it. So I apologize in advance uh, to anyone who's receiving a gift from me this Christmas. I'm not very good at wrapping presents. But yes, very quick turnaround, getting my climbing gear on and heading out. So I will see you. These are supposed to be easy peelers. This is at least moderately difficult to peel. So yes, I will see you later on. So, I am back from climbing now. That was quite fun actually. Always enjoy that, over at the Climbing Works in Sheffield. So there's only one thing left to do today, and that's of course open the advent calendar. So let's see what's behind door number 20. Can you draw Santa? <sighs> no. He's got a face. He's got a hat. It goes around like that, and then... He's got eyes, eyebrows, they're very severe eyebrows. Just give him a big smile. He's got a beard, Jeff. Most of my drawing ability, I've also only got a pencil. That's the other thing that's worth saying. Yeah, most of my drawing ability comes from things I learned from Neil Buchanan on Art Attack. Uh, so I tend to draw like sausage people. That, that's, this is so bad. Put the standard issue Santa jacket. <laughs> so Santa has a cape now. That's it, uh, that's canon. He does have hair though, curly hair. Almost like Kit Harrington. This is terrible. It's given some pupils. Forgot about that. And uh, there you have it. That <laughs> That's what Santa looks like. I feel like I've earned my chocolate now. And it's Santa. Let's do a side by side. Yeah, could be, could be the same thing. Oh dear. And that, folks, is all we've got time for today in this episode of Vlogmas. I will see you tomorrow for yet another episode of Vlogmas. I'll see you then. Bye.